Greetings and uh, welcome to the inaugural video for the Mobile Forensic Minute, MFM. Hey, I'm Lee Reber and uh, I just figured that I would put some videos up, you know, maybe a minute, minute and a half, uh, doesn't matter where I'm at, uh, just put some videos up on mobile device forensics. So it could be a file system, it could be a case, uh, it could be looking at an Android or iOS, uh, something to better us as forensic examiners because you know there's quite a uh, pe you know few people doing mobile device uh, forensics but uh, but honestly uh, I, I find out in, in training that uh, it's an issue right it's an issue of uh, the time factor it's an issue of they just don't have enough knowledge uh, so you know hopefully during this minute minute and a half that we do every week I can give you a nugget you know some mobile forensic nugget that might help out in your investigations uh, so I'll try to keep them to a minute uh, no more than a minute and a half in your uh, in your video because I know time is precious especially if you're going to be uh, you know working a full caseload or have another job so look at it as a time to maybe learn something maybe solidify you know solidify something you already know uh, or uh, you know just make fun of me so again, I'm Lee Reber, and uh, we'll be talking a lot about the uh, my book, Mobile Forensic Investigations, during this time. Uh, so you can go and subscribe on Facebook at uh, facebook.com forward slash mobile forensic book, or just follow me on Twitter. Uh, I'm at Celdet, and also be uh, tweeting at uh, mobile device ESI. So look us up, and uh, I look forward to maybe showing you something new. Thanks. <music>